In this video I will instruct you on how to set up color filter by Metobject and Metafield. First of all, please go to Metobject on your admin page and click on Add Definition. Write any name you want. At fields, I will add a field single line text. Write name is color. Adding a color field and naming color code because I will write the code of color I want in it. And the last one need to be added is file. Name it as image. And save my change. OK. Back to MetaJet page you can see the definition I have created. Go to and click on at entry. For each entry, you will write the colored you want to show, for example. If you don't want to use the color existing, you can find a web that provide you with an accurate color. For example, I will add some more entries. Go to Settings and Custom Data. Go to Products and click on Add Definition. Write any name you want. At the Select Type, let's find and choose MetaObject. Select MetaObject as the one I created before Color Filter Swatch. Change to list of entries. This is what I have done to create a meta field. Now go to product and open a product you want to edit. Here is the color meta field. This is the list of entries I added. I will select the colors that I want to filter out. The last part that needs to be created is filter in the search and discovery app. Click on Add Filter. Choose the color field from the meta field have created.
Let's check my demo. Here you see. Because I only add colors to one product so they show the number one. Now, if you want to show an image instead of a color, you can easily do that. Go to the color you want to edit. This is the image field. I will select a photo for this color. Another one. Back to the filter setting and click on display option. At the swatch pattern let's change to image option. OK let's check. You can see the blue and pink have changed to use image. This is the end of video. Thank you for watching.